Good evening. Thanks for joining us. Happy New Year and welcome to the 10 o'clock news. I'm Camilla Ortiz. First tonight, we're barely into the new year and tonight two different law enforcement agencies are investigating three different deadly shootings. Fox 12's Connor McCarthy tells us about a shooting in Gresham that left one person dead. New Year's Day and bullets are already flying in Gresham, leaving one person dead, according to police. There's somebody's son, somebody's daughter, a relative. These are family members. Reverend Mark Knutson is the chair of Lift Every Voice Oregon. He says this is no way to start off a new year. The loss of life is pure tragedy at any time, but to begin the new year with these rash of shootings, uh, even more so. Police say the shooting happened in a parking lot at the 700 block of Southeast 187th Avenue. So far, no suspects. They were gone by the time we got here, and I don't have enough of a, a you know, a confirmed suspect uh, description. As a native Portlander, Knutson is disturbed seeing a record number of shootings in the metro area in 2021. But 2022, he's hopeful things might change with two initiatives. Lift Every Voice is trying to get on the November ballot, including a ban on assault rifles and high capacity magazines. I've always found that action leads to energy. So if you're tired, take action, join in. We have to do something. Lift Every Voice has until July 8th to get 140,000 signatures to get their initiatives on the ballot. Knutson is confident they'll meet their goal. When people die in the streets, that is somebody's child. Just we got to remember that. That's not some abstract number. It's a human being. We need to rise up. When my neighbor bleeds, we all bleed. 